everyone. Um, in this video, I'll be going over how to basically control your mouse and keyboard. Um, but for first, I'll be showing how to just like a demo application of it. So I just made a quick Python script uh, using Pi Auto GUI, uh, and it allows me to control a mouse and keyboard so that I can press uh, the legal. I can just start League of Legends, type in my password, and then get ready to start a game. Basically, all the boring stuff you'd ever do. A lot of this information is from uh, the online tutorial for Pi Auto GUI and a, a website called Automate the Boring Stuff. Yeah, so let's begin. So first, let's just look at the pr a quick overview of the program. So here it is. This is just a shortcut to it. And this is Notepad++. So yeah, as you can see here, it's just the Pi Auto GUI, my custom library just is built on top of it, some, like, func some quick functions. And you can see here, look for the league, uh, the league picture here, and then just click on it. Look for the launch picture, click on it. Now we'll see this more in action when we actually run it. Uh, I won't really dive into this very much, but this is just some code if you want to look at it. So yeah, uh, let's just run this boy. So the thing is, this uh, this Python script depends on what the screen sees. So it needs to be able to see, yeah, as you can see here, I just clicked it. It needs to be able to actually see the symbol. So if it's different in any way, like this is not a very smart uh, program. If it's the picture is different in any way, you can't find it. You can see, it just automatically found that picture because it looked exactly the same on the screen. Clicks it, mm, wait a little bit. It does more. And then it even types in my password for me because for some reason, League doesn't automatically lock me in. I don't know why. It's just. Oh, I don't know. I guess this, I had to make this for it. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. So as you can see here, it takes a bit. Mid text box. And I think it's not, it's not a very fast program, nor is it optimized. As you can see, it's taking a bit to find the password box. And possibly not even finding it. Wow, interesting. I see, I see, I see. Okay. So I typed in the password. It just didn't notify me. Oh, it's actually bugging out. Oh, I think it's because I'm recording. Okay, I see. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I'm not very good at this recording stuff. I'm just doing this for fun. But, yeah. Just uh, we'll slowly wait. What a wonderful YouTube video because I am not editing this. Too much work. I'm just straight up recording this and putting it up. Yeah, a skip button would be great though. I recommend just skipping 10 seconds future. It's probably really good. Oh, feeling dead air. It's great. You should probably be on your phone right now. I know I'm gonna be. Really, lot, like a lot. I don't know what to do. Okay, after what is that? 120 seconds, finally loaded. Man, this recording program is killing my computer. Uh, let's see, what is it going to do now? It should click the play icon because I always click play blind pick. I believe in you. Come on. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Just press it. Press it. I see how it is. It worked perfectly fine, but when it actually comes down to it, betray me. Ah, <sighs> feels bad. Dang, this video is eating a shitload of GPU. Hmm. I should change that. Especially since this program uses so much, it has to search for it so hard. It's so dumb. Ah, 
it did it. Now I should click confirm. After we wait a bit. Again. I'm gonna take bets. Oh my god. Did it do it? Oh my computer is getting destroyed by this by this program. Holy crud. Okay. Okay, there we go. It did it. It's done. And now we are ready to find a match. There is actually another program. So yeah, voila. If you want to start league in like, you know, what is this, 10 minutes? That's how you do it. I'm gonna end the video and you're gonna, you're gonna watch me click this button because I am not editing this out.